This story is Barry the Fish with Fingers. Puffy the puffer fish could blow the best bubbles. Other fish would come from miles around to see his bubble blowing show. Big bubbles, small bubbles, round bubbles, square bubbles. They had never seen anything so amazing until they caught sight of Barry. Barry was no ordinary fish. Barry was a fish with fingers. Suddenly, everyone wanted to know more about the amazing fish with fingers. What can your fingers do, Barry? They asked. Tell us, tell us. Well, said Barry, fingers mean finger painting, knitting, cutting, and finger puppets. But best of all, fingers mean tickling. <laughs> the fish had never had so much fun. Come on, Puffy, said Barry, join in. But Puffy didn't want to join in. He was sad. Now nobody wants to see my bubble blowing show. I hate Barry's fingers, they're stupid. So while Puffy sulked off on his own, Barry and the other fish had a whale of a time, chasing each other through sea caves, in and out of seashells, and through seaweed. But all of a sudden, Barry stopped dead in his tracks. He heard a loud splash and a rumbling noise. Then the sea got darker and a big shadow covered the ocean. Oh no, cried Barry. Oh no, cried the fish. A huge crate had fallen into the water and was going to squash Puffy. Quick Barry, do something, the fish cried. And that was when Barry did something truly amazing. He pointed. Look out Puffy, he cried. With a loud crash, the crate hit the seabed. Was it too late? Had poor Puffy been squashed? Phew, no he hadn't. Thank you Barry, said Puffy. You saved my life. I'm sorry for being a grumpy spoil sport. Can we play Tickle Chase? But Barry had a better idea. Let's party! Take it away, Puffy! So Barry played the piano and Puffy blew the trumpet. And everyone had the best time ever. And that was a story of Barry the fish with fingers. <laughs>